Well, you talked about being an abstract painter. What is the name of this painting that's here? And what does it tell us? What do all these lines mean? How do you tell a story in this abstract kind of way? Uh, this painting is missing, uh, the name of this painting is Mr. Charles. Uh, it was painted <coughs> in 1987 and um, it was painted for my great friend Charles Whitehead who um, uh, was um, a chauffeur and who lost uh, the use of his uh, um, legs in an automobile accident. And uh, Charles was one of those people who um, upon um, uh, receiving this serious blow to his life just showed us all uh, you know the kind of perseverance that you don't think you have in you until something like this happens and most of us don't think we have it when something like this happens but this guy never complained he never um, uh, he never gave it a single moment's thought that that he wouldn't be able to go on and be a vibrant person in life and so when I tell a story in this uh, these lines, the, the color um, to me represents the spirit of Charles, I you see. know, the motion. And there's a space uh, for abstract painters that is created in the process of painting that, um, that th there's a depth in the painting and there's a depth in the human being. Um, um, so you actually are telling a story, but how does the public relate to this? If you didn't tell us the story of that, I would look at it and say, I love the color, I love the depth, and this is really interesting the way he's done these. I, I thought they were African symbols. Yes. Are they? They're not, but they're based <laughs> on African symbols. Uh, and that's all I would get out of it. I wouldn't know the story of, of him. I think that the intensity of my uh, uh, emotion in the process of painting is what comes through in the painting. Ah. And uh, the fact that I name the painting after uh, a person who has given me so much um, uh, relates to the viewer in the sense that they get that intensity. So they feel, if, if you like it, it's something that you feel or you, you can see what the artist has put into it. Yes. This is something new to me, this big painting on the set. I haven't seen this work and it looks almost representational and I thought all you did was abstract work. Well, this is from an earlier period when um, uh, for me uh, <coughs> there was um, uh, more of an interest in color field painting, uh, more of an interest in, in symbolism. Uh, I started uh, out by studying African uh, systems of symbols uh -huh. and um, uh, at a certain point, I realized that I was going to have to create my own body of uh, symbolism. And this painting is basically, it, the name of it is Team Picture. And uh, it's, a, it's about my family because my father always referred to our family as the team. I see. And uh, so the symbols in it, uh, 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 the, especially the representational ones, are about things that he touched or that my mother touched uh, I see. in oh, their that? everyday working life. I see. Yes. The other thing, uh, 